everybody. So I'm going to be piercing my tongue tonight. Yes, it's night time right now. Um, first disclaimer, big disclaimer, please do not try this at home. Um, especially if you're not sure if you have veins or anything in the bottom of your tongue because if you hit one of those, it could be really, really dangerous. Um, I luckily have already looked and I have two veins that run on the sides. So, um, yeah. I'm very nervous, actually. I've never had my tongue pierced. Um, I've done my septum several times. Uh, um, I've done my root twice. Um, I did my second nostril once. Um, which I didn't keep that one, but... Um, but the tongue is a totally different thing, so I don't know. And I don't even know if I'm going to like it or not, so... I'm really nervous, um, and the only reason I'm not wearing gloves is because my nails are super long. Um, I do have me a little grasping tool that I can grasp the, um, jewelry with. Um, this jewelry, it's not super, super long, but it's a little bit longer than the standard, um, size. So I'm hoping that'll be fine. I mean, I don't have a super thick tongue anyway. It's actually pretty thin. Um, so I don't think I'll swell too, too bad. Um, but I do plan on, you know, sucking on crushed ice and taking some ibuprofen and stuff. So <sighs> fingers crossed that this works out. Um, so yeah, let's get started. I'm going to mark it first on the bottom. I'm going to try, I think I'm going to pierce it from the bottom up just to make sure that I'm clear from my veins. Um, so yeah. I'm going to open up my package of my 14 gauge needle. And I have already brushed my teeth and washed my mouth out with mouthwash. Clean the jewelry. Get this little plastic thing off. Oh, I'm so nervous. I feel like it's going to be like really, really, really painful, but I don't know. I've never done it before. So let me mark the bottom of my tongue. Okay, it doesn't want to mark. See if I can find something that will mark. Okay, I'm gonna dry my tongue off. And this is clean. I just don't have any more any paper towels, so
Wow, that is so weird. See how much longer the bar is? Um, it's a little bit longer than a God, it's weird to talk. Um, it's a little bit longer than a, a normal size that you would switch into. Um, and I purposely got it that way, so. And yes, I did get it a tad bit at an angle, but I did that on purpose because I wanted it to lay comfortably. Um, so... That's crazy. I can't believe I just pierced my own tongue. It wasn't as bad as I thought it was going to be. Um, it's going to be so weird and hard to get used to talking with it in. I mean, I don't have a lisp. I'm talking pretty normal. Maybe that's because I've had um, my tongue web pierced a couple of times. So I know the feeling of something down there. But that's pretty awesome. Look at my lips is a little weird. Can't believe I did that. That's pretty awesome. I think I pull off a tongue ring pretty good. Still a little bloody. Yeah, I felt it more on the bottom of my tongue than I did at the top when the needle was going through. 
I felt it more in the bottom than I did the top. Well, that's that. <laughs> I hope you enjoyed this video. Give it a thumbs up if you liked it. And no hate comments, please. If you don't like people piercing at home, then just don't watch it. So, have a good one. Goodbye.